McDonald at Dobo Duda, 15th of October, 1943. A historically based mission for the free Aces High Combat Flight Simulator, filmed live using Aces High 2.12.4, based on actual events from the New Guinea Campaign of 1943. On the 15th of October, 1943, the radar operator at Oro Bay, New Guinea, detected a large force of enemy planes heading for the American base at Dobo Duda. Fortunately, the warning came soon enough for the hard-flying P-38 pilots to scramble to altitude, and those on alert took off immediately. Back at the camp, which was a good distance from the airstrip, pilots tumbled out of their tents and set out for the strip in anything that had wheels. Major Charles McDonald and Captain William N. Ivey set an unofficial Jeep speed record from a standing start in their dash to the airstrip stealing two available planes from the 433rd Squadron. They took off and climbed to meet the enemy. In all, 51 P-38s got into the air to engage the enemy force of 60 incoming planes. Their aerial battle which ensued was viewed with intense pleasure by the group's ground personnel right over their airbase because it was the first time they had seen their own pilots in action. In that battle, 36 Japanese planes were destroyed. McDonald's 475th fighter group suffered no losses, and only 95 planes weighed down. Point one. Major McDonald and Captain Ivy were well rewarded for their speedy dash to the flight line. They each destroyed two Japanese aircraft. Unfortunately, Major McDonald couldn't repay the 433rd Squadron for his borrowed aircraft, which he was forced to crash land upon his safe return. Let's see how you do as a member of McDonald's 475th fighter group on this fateful morning. Get to altitude as fast as you can, and follow the group for intercept. Oro Bay Radar, Oro Bay Radar, this is McDonald. Can you give us an update on those bogeys, please? Roger, H. McDonald, this is Night Oro Bay Radar. Waypoint I have a large blip coming in from the north. Right now, it's about uh, 1 o'clock from your position. About one o'clock from Double Dura, range 75 miles. Night, waypoint south. three. Repeat, one o'clock from Double Dura, 75 miles. Roger, Oro Bay, have you. We have one set, large set of bandits coming in from the north. One o'clock to our Night, position, 75 point miles four. out. We're going to climb to intercept. Everybody stay with me. I suggest we climb uh, north. Try to loop up, get above them, and loop up behind them and catch them on the inbound. All right, I'm now climbing through 6,000 feet. Let's keep up with the climb. Major McDonald, what is your fuel situation? I don't have a lot of fuel. I had to take off with half a tank. Roger that. That's me, too. I took off with half a tank. So hopefully the light load will help us get a good altitude. We don't have to go very far here. They're on their way in. Roger that. Oro Bay, this is McDonald again. Oro Bay, this is McDonald. Can you update the position on those bogeys? Roger that. McDonald, I still have them. They're coming down straight south. They're now about uh, 50 miles. 50 miles from Dobo Dura at your 1 o'clock. Night, waypoint six. Okay, guys, let's turn around and try to spot them. They're going to be of us pretty soon. Auto Bay Radar, do you have our position? Roger that. We see you. You are at 2 o'clock from Dobodura. About 15 or 16 miles out. You should 
see the bandits ahead of you now? Off to the east. You've gone far enough north, the bandits should be to the east somewhere. Okay, everybody, keep your eyes open. Let's see if we can spot them. Everybody watch for those bandits. Major Metal, this is close as I see them. 11 o'clock low, 11 o'clock low, many bandits. Okay, I see a... Uh... I see a large formation of bogies at our at our 11 o'clock low. Looks like uh, looks like bombers in formation. Continue south, and we're going to intercept these guys. I see one, two, three, four, five groups of bombers. At least five groups of bombers. I don't see any escorting fighters yet. Everybody, keep your eyes peeled for fighters. Fighters have got to be around here someplace. Everybody look up. Watch for them. I don't see them. Let's go in. Fighters are not here. Let's not wait. Oh, okay. See, I see the fighters coming in at a distance. we got a clear pass at the bombers. Let's take a few shots. Seven. Incidentally, Major MacDonald survived the battle and the war and became the third highest ranking American ace in the Pacific Theater.